Oh. Oh, hey. Wait. You're the one who, like, you want to see the room, right? Yeah? It's time, dudes. official nintendo seal certified by nintendo reggie actually came over and uh he said so so come on in all right so uh over here first thing uh behind the door the wizard poster you know the 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 classic movie that first advertised super mario bros 3 now uh i actually never even seen this movie so i'm kind of a fraud but uh it's pretty cool right we have a gta poster of a los santos this is about nintendo so uh on to the cool sh God made little boys. Look at cute old little me there. Oh, I was supposed to be a professional soccer player, but I just became a god gamer instead. All right, so here's the amiibo shelf. One of my most prized possessions. I worked very hard on it, you know? I, I got up 6 a.m. on amiibo release dates, and I would walk to Walmart just to butt in line in front of all the moms who were trying to buy their kids some toys, and I said, nope. That's kind of how I got a lot of these. I actually stopped collecting amiibo around when Breath of the Wild came out. For some reason, the price went up another, like, $5 or something, and I was like... Also, I have I have way too many of these. As you might be able to see, I have literally no room. Kind of hard to put amiibos anywhere anymore. I love my meebs. My meebs are my loves. Moving on down a little bit here, we have the handheld slash little sh stack of PS1 collection over here. Because you know we're uh, we're Nintendo gamers. We got the GBA slash Game Boy Color whatever stuff over here. Got some Pokemon's. Like just 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 look just look at. These. You like that, eh? You want that? Yeah? If you comment bean this, you might win this. We have, you know, some cute little other knickknacks around the place here. We got uh, a question block. You know, I keep all my tools, all my uh, diddle daddles that uh, I don't know what to do with. We kind of just throw it in there. One day, I was just, you know, I, I was just sleeping. My father wakes me up and he just throws this at me. And then he's like, hey, I bought this at a garage sale for you. It was like a dollar. And I was like, Oh, sh thanks, dog. And now on this shelf, we have the N64 games. You know, we got classics like Paper Mario, Madden 99, Harvest Moon 64, Pokemon Stadium. You know, all the games you love. Super Bowling. They're all here. I got them all, dude. On the floor over here, we actually have uh, we have the dance pad all folded up. We might get dancing. We might get moving and grooving. The Wii balance board snug under that. More Wii Fit coming soon. Coming down here, we have... Ooh. Is that another non-Nintendo piece in my collection? Excuse me? Wait, what? I, honestly, like, I like Doom. But I forget what this guy's name is. I think it's like the Ren... <laughs> Is it like the Renovant or the 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 Renovant <laughs> or like the you know it's it's just, it's just the irrelevant like f it let's just ignore that. All right now this is the part that you guys would uh, definitely want to see. This is all the main games. My favorite console to collect for is actually NES. However, my favorite console of all time is GameCube. I have pretty much every solid GameCube game you could imagine. However, something that bugs collectors is player's choice. You know the ones with the uh, with the yellow labels? I kind of got rid of all those. I had some pretty solid games in player's choice form, but I kind of just yeeted those. All about that black label, baby. Anyway, some Wii games. Uh, oh yeah, down below. Yeah, let's just ignore those. That's PlayStation 2, Xbox, Xbox 360. Y'all didn't come here for that shit. Oh, the Wii U games. I actually really hate the Wii U. I'm probably never gonna play like any of these games ever. Like, why do I even have this? Tokyo Mirage, it's still sealed. Both my Star Foxes are sealed, dude. This just goes to, sh like, I just love the Wii U, dude. Uh, you know, a couple cute little SNES and N64 boxes. We got that Conkers. Dude, I I'm gonna be honest, I haven't played like, I probably only played like 1% of this shit. I'm kind of a fake gamer. I only, I only maybe play like two or three games and spend like thousands of hours on those. That's the right way to do it. You know, some more SNES and Genesis and random Master System stuff. I don't even own a Master System, not gonna lie. NES, Intellivision, is, honestly, these are kind of gross to me. Intellivision is uh, not my thing, but I kind of just used it to fill out the shelf, I'm gonna be honest, so. More Amiibos. 
up top, as you can see. Uh, most of these are kind of just the uh, Animal Crossing collection. I don't know what to do with those, so I kind of threw those up. And we got the Smash DLC lineup from Wii U. Some little Pixel Pals, you know, little poor man's amiibo, but I think I think they're pretty cool. Let's go Pikachu. Never played it. Probably never will. We got that Sword and Shield coming out. Hopefully Gun comes out too. I'll probably be playing that. Here's the cartridges. We got classes. We got a whole series up here. We got the whole Ninja Gaiden trilogy, Mario Bros. Double Dragon trilogy, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles trilogy. We got the first four Mega Mans. I actually don't own five and six. There's a little more on the expensive side. Castlevanias, Contra. Let me tell you about Contra, dude. This game is amazing. Fun little fact, I was actually playing this game with my cousin years and years ago on some fake NES knockoff Chinese aftermarket console, whatever you want to call it, and I accidentally punched in the Konami code. I shit you not. It happened. We were freaking out, and then we never knew, because I didn't even know how to use the internet at the time, so uh, we didn't think it was real, but that shit happened, believe it or not. All right, now coming over here, uh, got the windows, Zelda sword and shield kirby plushes we got a brawl shower curtain y'all know me i'm a melee guy if i could i would replace that with melee this actually used to be my old stream setup when i was first getting into streaming this is my backdrop but now it's just a fancy little cool corner curtain ben q monitor with a nintendo switch dock ready to play as most of you know i have two switches i love the switch and you know it's very convenient because whenever the homies come over we want to just game out guess what <sighs> They just sit down, plop the switch down. We're gaming, boys. Uh, down below here, this is my Sony Trinitron 32-inch flat screen CRT. Absolutely amazing TV. Unfortunately, my room is really small. I'm gonna have to move a ton of stuff to get this thing up and going. If you want to get some retro games going... You want this bad boy in your room. All right, so as you can see, against these walls, you know, we got the Nintendo Power magazines. Shout out to my cousin, Joey, hooking me up with all his old Nintendo powers. I just yoinked all these out of there, and uh, looks amazing. All right, so up here, we have Breath of the Wild Special Edition. You know, other kinds of special editions. We got Street Fighter. We got a Game Boy in the box. NES Genesis. We got the NES Classic Edition and the Super Nintendo Entertainment System Classic. Never open those, because I don't need to, because... Uh, <laughs> Guess what? We own all the games on the original cartridges. Yeah, that's right, all you peasants. Get on my level. Hey, you Pikachu, a GameCube, and up here, uh, Super Mario Cereal. The cereal is still in there. I've actually never tasted it yet. Uh, shout outs to Travis for hooking me up with that. A couple of GameCube controller boxes. We got a Super Nintendo, an Xbox. Ooh, shouldn't say that name around here. Ooh, Connect. Ooh, ooh, PS3. Whoops. Um,. We can cut that out. A couple more amiibos. You know, we got like the double pack, you know, Ali and Marie. We got Toon Link and Toon Zelda. Special edition Wii U with Wind Waker HD. Some plushies, you know. Uh, this crown I'm wearing is actually King Boo's. I kind of just stole it for the video because, you know, I just I want to I wanna look more presentable. I, I, need, I needed to look wealthy and rich. I'll hook you up after the video is done, bub. But yeah, some Mario plushes. We got the Game Boy, some handheld stuff. 3DS XL. Uh, World of Nintendo figures. You know, that's those are really actually the uh, poor man. Man's amiibo, but garage sale, 20 bucks for the set. Why not? Some more plushies, N64 controller, N64 box, new 3DS XL. Probably played it for like five minutes, never touched it again. Uh, rip 3DS. I'm so sorry, you know, the Wii is uh, quite the console, but uh, Mew and Bonsley, or whatever his name is, kind of got in the way, so uh, rip that idea. Here's my two switches. You know, this is the one I got on launch, stayed up all night freezing cold i think i got multiple frostbites that night camping out at walmart Ooh, two xbox 360s let's not talk about those we got a little smash loot box i got that at twitchcon i believe this is the only thing i still have from it i think look at it look at it just grows back dude isn't that amazing it smells like strawberries it's phenomenal like i would trade a ton of things in my room just to keep this i love this thing anyways we got dragonite we got shadow more pokemon Wii mini some skylanders the only reason i even own that skylanders thing at all is because guess what guess what it says amiibo on it oh wow nitro's gotta get all the amiibo oh it just has donkey kong on the cover oh that's all dude see they got me good they got me dude 
You just put them, you slap amiibo on anything. I kind of stopped buying amiibo. 2015 Nitro would buy anything with amiibo on it. Donkey Kong Jr. little mini classics. A Pokedex sealed away. Beautiful, beautiful. One of my favorite things. Now you might be wondering, what is with this towel covering this whiteboard? Well, actually, uh, I got a bunch of big brain ideas. You know, whenever I have something, uh, poof, pops in my head, little idea, right on the board keep the juices flowing so uh, i put a towel over there because uh, i'm not sharing my secrets maybe one day uh we got local news on the wall city's gaming scene on the map that was actually a tournament i hosted a long time ago our gaming scene was supposed to be on the map but it kind of just died because i stopped hosting tourneys I'm, I'm, a I'm a horrible host looking below here this is actually my setup believe it or not this is my dresser. Uh, there are some clothes in there. There's some random cords. We got plenty of drawer space. So it is kind of weird. This isn't your typical desk. This is very unorthodox, the way this works. So this is the chair I sit on. Pretty comfy. I mean, as you can tell, there's actually a little rip in it. Been giving the chair too much ass lately. It's having a hard time keeping up. Bluetooth wireless keyboard here. This is your, you know, your, your, your typical dad Sunday night football TV dinner stand right here. It's a little scuffed, but it works. You might also notice I have this mic stand right here. This pole is always in my way, by the way. For the last two years, I've been playing with a big giant fat pole in my face with games. I'm kind of used to it. It just, it is how it is. Over here, see, this is where we play the video games. Uh, we got Mario 64 on the CRT, you know, for the, for the oldies. We got Mario Maker 2 on this screen over here. Great game, great game. Oh, wait, and what is that? Ooh, there's a Wii U on the ground. Yikes, dude. The Wii U is officially dead. Thank you, Mario Maker 2, finally killing that hunk of shit. By the way, guys, if we get a thousand likes on this video, I will destroy my Wii U. Smash that like button, destroy that like button, dude. One like is one destroy to the Wii U. Just keep that in mind. We got the razor blade laptop over here. You know, whenever I whenever I need an extra screen, have something else going on there, you know, it could be convenient once in a while. Ooh, Gucci goggles. We got the Gucci gogs. Gonna have to put, the, put those on somehow. Uh, here's my PC. We got the monitors up here. You know, we got the essentials. Look at that. We Fit, Melee, Mario... Ma ooh, ooh, no, that's the old Mario Maker. We don't, uh, we don't talk about that anymore. We Play, the NES on top of the PC. Uh, we got the recorder, you know, in case, uh, in case the tunes need to be played. It's always on deck. A little, little granola bar, you know, if you get hungry, if you're gaming out too hard, you know where to find it. With the Wii Sports headbands. Make sure, uh, check out the stream. We're gonna be doing a lot of Wii Sports. My two favorite Nintendo Power issues, the final issue and the Ocarina of Time issue, both sealed, and I framed them, slapped them up there. Absolutely gorgeous. I wanna thank you so very much for watching. Make sure to like, make sure to sub. Make sure to follow the stream if you're not. We'll be streaming a ton. Nice little surprise coming up there for you, bubs. And, uh, yeah. This has been Nicro's Room Tour. Hope you enjoyed. As always, remember to stay cute, stay wild, stay fresh, stay lit, and most importantly, stay safe. Bye! Something I forgot to mention in the video is, uh, my Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival <laughs> collection. I have about, uh, four, four copies of that. And we got three chibi robos, don't ask why. Also, uh, I have about, like, ten GameCube controllers, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Editions. Um, yeah, I don't know, that, that was another cool little piece that I thought I'd throw in that I missed. Also, uh... Here's the Kleenex box, in case uh, we have some little accidents, you know, if we spill some gamer juice or something. And there's my garbage.